In an age when speed has been sacrificed for safety, one car stands alone. Light speed acceleration, yet no ABS. No seatbelt to restrain you, no airbag to save you. In fact, crash and you're not. Be this virtuous takes virtue racing. <laughs> to be this good takes. What's that? No, sir. We're not at the Saturn. <laughs> at the Saturn point of the Sega-a-thon. We're still on the Sega Genesis part. That's right. Look at that. 3D on the Sega Genesis. I know, let's make it look like you think it was all was on the Saturn. Or the 32X, at least. Yeah. Which there is a version of it on the 32X and a version of it on the Saturn. But... And also, if you look at the bottom left, it's the same people that made Daytona. Yeah, and a bunch of other Sega stuff, like Virtual Fighter and shit. But anyway... So, greetings viewers, it is I, Nick. And it's me, Mark. And welcome to Virtual Racing on the Sega Genesis. Yes, welcome to Kart Racing Month. So, <laughs> um, so this game, uh, we weren't originally planning to do this for the sega -thon, but, um, but because, uh, we've been watching, uh, well, we always saw that at our, at our local game store just sitting there, but I, I, like, I was like, whatever, you know, whatever. It, I'm gonna say this right now. If, if it wasn't for the Sega Thon, I may or may not have probably wanted to pick this up. But it's the mo another incentive for me to picking this game up was we were watching um, a guy who was reviewing a bunch of the Sa a bunch of Sega Saturn games, all American releases in order. He's um called a uh, Pandemonium reviews every Sega Saturn game. So I watched his review of it, and I was like, you know what? This is actually pretty cool. So I got it, and here we are. So, now, some people might be saying, well, big deal, Super Nintendo could do this too, but this game runs better than all those games that were on the Super Nintendo, aka Star Fox and that, um, what was it, RC Pro-Am? Mm -hmm. Because those games, like, they're fine. Hey, I like Star Fox a lot, but look how fast I'm going, and the frame rate isn't that bad. Especially for the console it's on, it's not that bad. So yeah, so we're playing Virtual Racing, and it's two players. It can run well, and it's in two players? Hell yeah! 3D! She. So yeah, so uh, we're gonna be going through all three tracks. Um, I haven't, we tried recording this before, but um, uh, when we tried doing it through Elgato, uh, the, the Elgato program itself couldn't handle it because we were going too fast. So fast. It, it happens to it, it, it's it's because of the bit rate. You can't on the um, our laptop can keep up with the bit rate. That's what happens when every time I try to fucking record Sonic Unleashed. Mm -hmm. So if anyone's asking when are we when are you guys ever doing Sonic Unleashed? At, at this point, until unless we get a stronger computer slash laptop, or, never. Well, I was going to say also we're not even. I mean, if we're going bit based off of how you do things we got a long way yeah but i'm go. just saying if there's no way for us to do sonic at least at this point so yeah so um we're just gonna run through the a couple of tracks um i'm now i'm less familiar of it because i haven't played this in a while because we haven't recorded this in a while so yeah oh right y y do you like it how so so okay if anyone doesn't know the drive button is b so usually the whole time you're playing this game, you're pressing B. So your so, brain so, thinks confirm is B, but so, no, they put confirm on A or start, but B. So I'm on the top, Mark's on the bottom. So um, to play this game, you the B button is drive, A button is brake. And uh, C button is to change the camera angle, which I will do in quite a minute. Which, like, oh, look at that. Oh, man, look at that draw distance you can do on here. Wow. 
Oh, you didn't even go any further! But it's fucking hard to do if you're too zoomed in. Yeah, I, I, I crashed because I, I did that. You know, sometimes if you're going too fast, just let go of the fucking dry button. And get off the fucking grass. I used to be good at this track. Well, you're still ahead of me right now. Yeah, but 46? That's fucking slow as fuck. I was doing the test. I was actually doing a practice run of this to the before we started recording. Does it make sure everything runs fine for the recording? Mm. And uh, I got <laughs> my laps were 40 39s. What is this bullshit? I'm going too slow. You're going too slow. I crashed again. Yeah, yeah, you know, just gotta memorize. Well, I'll, what basically what I'm doing is fucking th going through muscle memory right now. How many times did you went through this track? Oh, during the test? Oh, yeah. I didn't even finish the race. I just did like two laps, and I was like, okay, I'm good. You haven't crashed yet? Uh, if I did, it would have been on the first lap. The best way to make turns better is to actually kiss the the the, the side where the turn is, you know, the, the, so you can not spin out during the turn or hit the wall by accident. I'm doing a horrible way of explaining that, by the way. Like, when it makes the turn, hit the side where... I, I, I can't, I'm, I'm trying to drive and try to, I don't know the way to describe this properly without using my brain too much. Yes, I require brain power just to tell everyone, like, what, what I just did without touching the grass. When you're making turns, do that. You, you can make the turns better. Kind of hard to talk and yeah, cause focus like, on this. Yeah, you saw what just happened to me right there. You know, I see right here, you can, well, this one's an like easy turn. Right here, I tend to let go of the... Uh, the the big ass at certain points when I'm making this S turn, I mean like this S road right here, so I don't go too fast and I just fucking hit a wall or some shit. Yeah, this um this race you don't really need to use your brakes. You oh no 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 no, you need to use your brakes. No, I don't. I don't. The use big it. turn you use it's, it's so you can keep maintaining speed on the big turn at the end. You need to use the brakes. Letting go doesn't like like if you're trying to go as fast as possible, you need to let go. You have to hit the brake while you're driving. You need to do that if you want to get in first place when you're playing by yourself. Shit. Well, Nick won this race already. Yeah, because yeah, you need to learn how to do that. That's how I keep kept in consistent 40s. Like, if you sometimes you don't need to hit brakes, so you just need to let go of the pedal on certain turns. And that's what I kept doing. Because honestly, even on that turn, the big turn, you can still accelerate, but you just have you have to hit brake while you're accelerating. So okay, uh, we're going to hit to race two. These uh, so when I first played this, I played the shit out of the first level. And then didn't touch the rest. And the only time we did I did any of these is when we did it on the first recording. So I'm less familiar with these. So CB crashed as much as Mark did in, in the first one. The one once I get the, the track I did the best in is the second one. I remember there's a point where there's a big hard turn that you gotta fucking break super early on. Shit. Oh. Shit. <laughs> okay, this is one thing I'll say at least for the Genesis version. The draw distance isn't great, so you... On oh, shit! What just happened? Did you I ran, I, yeah, I ran into you. So, the draw distance isn't that great. So there's a good chance of you just gonna be fucking be like, wait, what was that? And then you fucking spin out or hit a wall or some shit. 
Because you missed the turn because you didn't see what was coming ahead. I know there's a fucking map. But you're, are you going to actually be paying attention to the map while you're trying to fucking go fast? So I, I try to do it when it's a straightaway. Yeah, but that's still not... That, to me, that's still not enough to prepare. Like, as a... Because, like, if... Okay, if you actually want the... If you really want to play this seriously, fucking go get the one... Go get the version of it on Switch. Because, um... You know how, like, in, you know, Japan usually likes to act... Like, throw away their... I, I drove into a rock. I, um, like to throw away their, uh... All their stuff when they finish a the game. So they don't have any more of their source stuff anymore. So, um... Someone actually had some some of um a disc of all the original data they just had it it was one of the developers they just had it in their home they're like oh shit so um they made they were they uh re you know got it and basically made the perfect version of virtual racing now uh, you know the best version is on switch so like i said you want to play this game pick it up on switch that's the best version uh, i guess if you want to see like a like you know you know, an equivalent Te technology equivalent, pushed to its limit. Yeah, like an equivalent of oh look, Resident Evil and then sixty four, like that kind of thing. Then yeah, sure, pick this up. Yeah, cause if you spin, if you t turn too much, then you, yeah, you spin out, which sucks. Cause you gotta, that means you gotta slow down. E oh, slow down even harder. <laughs> don't crash the neck. Don't crash the neck. That's what I did last time. Whew. That's funny though, you said the guy just randomly just had it in his house. Well, he, he kept it. Maybe because he could maybe because one he thought ahead. He's like, wait, deleting it? I put so much work into this. I'm keeping this. Oh fuck. And just didn't tell anyone. But then someone, when they were like, okay, we need to make this, and then they say, insert this guy here. I think he still has that disc. And, they, and then the other team's like, I'm like, what? And they went to his house and like, yo, do you still have that? And he's like, yeah. He's like, I'm not like y'all destroying my work. Because, I mean, there's so many games that are just like, we can't re-release these ever again. Sega. Because, because we would have to redo everything from the ground up. This is probably one of the reason, main reasons why we'll never see Skies of Arcadia released on any other console. <sighs> Such a shame. And you're like, well, why won't they just remake it? Uh, Skies of Arcadia is kind of too niche. Oh, that was my best lap. Uh, yeah, this one was my best lap, too. 44. Okay, get ready for us to fuck up so bad. Mark, you're on handicap too. Oh. I want to pay attention to that because I don't know. Because, um, you know, it might have it it went harder on you because of that. Look at the background, guys. Look how good looking it is. Shit, Nick! I didn't do anything. Yeah, you did. You crashed in front of me. Well, that's your fault for running into me. I'm on the. I'm, I'm already on the right side. We didn't crash to you if you would. If you kept yourself in the track. Well, that's your problem. I'm over here and you're over there. Oh, oh, I, I was like, what the fuck is that? What the fuck's that square? It's like, oh, that was a. I, I actually, I still don't know what it is. Oh yeah, this turn. You have to break super. You gotta break way earlier to get through this fucking U turn. We. Shit. 
Shit. Oh, I think it should be a flag coming soon. Or, I, I assume it's a flag. Yeah, right here, yeah, okay. Ooh, I made actually a nice turn on that one. Uh, break here? Yeah, break here. Oh, you, uh, don't, don't let go of brake. Don't, don't, let go of drive. You know what? Just let go of the pedal. Stop trying to think like, oh, this is the time to go fast. No. Slow down. Sonic says slow down. Sometimes you don't have to go fast. Sometimes you need to slow down. Sometimes going slow is actually fast. Keep forgetting that fucking part. <laughs> Shit. Forgot about that. I'm not, I'm not I'm not looking at the map anymore, that's the problem. Well, I mean kinda of how the road looks, you kinda of don't want to look at the map. I mean, that was okay, but it could have been better. Turn. At least I didn't spin out this time. Let's see if I remember this fucking turn again. It should be right here. Whoa! At least I didn't hit the railing this time. That's positive. I, I run into that. Cool. Awesome. Amazing. I love it. Mmm. I was like, wait, where else? <laughs> See, that? this is why I'm trying to look at the fucking map. Hmm, if I, maybe if I go lower on the left side, maybe I could make that turn better. The one thing I appreciate with these racing games, all the, the virtual racing games I've tried, like uh, Sega, I did say, I play a little bit of Sega Rally and a little bit of Daytona as well. I'm happy that all the cars play differently. They don't feel exactly the same. Like, at least for virtual racing, I feel like I can get, I can get away with more shit than I can when making turns than in, in Daytona. That's good. Because I think Daytona, out of all the ones I played, I think it's the hardest one. Oh, fucking grass. Oof. What was my best lap? Not me. Oh, there. 58. I would say, though, um, uh, I did better uh, in the previous recording. No, 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 no. Like, if you look at my times, as an average. Yeah, I, uh, I have a better average than you. Yeah, because a good chunk of them I had was threes, fours, and threes. It's just because the the one, the second and third lap I did really re well. It's mostly because the second lap I did super well on. All right, well we ran through all of them. So what do you want to do now? Uh, let's go through. Uh, do you want to increase the lap? No. <laughs> let's go, let's because go the at first the, one. Because at a certain point, if you increase the laps, a certain point, what's just gonna happen is I, I press B. Did you did you press start? Mm -hmm. Okay, because I was gonna I was gonna accidentally press B again. 
Because, like, the only thing about it is this isn't, like, you know, it ain't Mario Kart. There's no rubber banding in here, so if you're fucking losing, well, you can just get fucked. Yeah. Sorry for the focus when I see another car in front of me. Yeah. You, like, when I got first place for the first time in, on here, you don't know how much I was fucking sweating bullets, and I'm overlapping the other right, drivers, so I'm like, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. <laughs> don't hit anyone, please, for the love of God, don't hit anyone. You're always going to be do going super slow on your first lap, because you're not going super speeds at the start of it. So I don't know if I did really well on that lap or not. Well, I'm not gonna do it super well on this lap now. Because <laughs> now, until Mark catches up to me, this is just fucking time trials right now. I wonder if that crash is what added those two extra seconds. Probably. That was my worst lap. Not really much to talk about because there's not that many levels in this game. Well, it's usually kind of one of those you're supposed to master them. Because, like, I tell you right now, if you're trying to aim for first place, it's super hard to do. So, you're actually going to put a lot of time onto this. It's just, if you're just playing with a buddy, yeah, this is it. This is all you get. These are these are how are with these Sega racing games. You only usually get three tracks, and that's it. I know um, Daytona, the later versions of it, has more tracks, but that's like you know, the later versions. Because out of the we already have the first Daytona game on Saturn, but the next one there's another one which is two players on it on the Saturn, and it has more tracks than the first one. I would love to get that one. See, this is why I'm trying to do something cool and new. Doesn't matter, you're look how far ahead of you are. Yeah. I wanna beat my times, god damn it! See, that's what I mean, like, you got a break on that turn. What made you think I wasn't breaking? No, hang on to the break. I heard you just tap it. No, you actually need to hang on to the break. I guess we'll do this one now. God. <laughs> Press start! I think drafting is a thing in this game, but I'm not, at least the game, if it is, the game doesn't, like, visually show you. You see what happened when I crashed in it, guys? 
Yeah, because some uh, that those kind of crashes actually benefit um can benefit you in the race too. Because uh, if some if you just get you you know you get right behind someone and they just fucking bump you, you technically you know it still counts as a crash, but it's better than just crashing on nothing. Because at least the bump would push you forward, so you're basically getting more speed back. Oh shit. Hey, you forgot about that turn? Mm. Also, if you see yourself you're about to spin out on a turn, just fucking hold on to the brake. Look, just take the L and go slower. It's better than spinning out. Yeah, I was too far away. Even if I was making, because I was making a bunch of good turns, it doesn't matter. I'm too far away. To be honest, I felt like that was gonna be my best lap. Oh, Nick. Oh, I thought I thought it ended. <laughs> no, you have to finish the race. My best lap was 46. Yeah, see, look, I I, I was doing shit. And you got that one... You, your last lap was probably your best one. Oh, yeah, because once I knew you was, like, right behind me, I was like, I have to be perfect to keep, make sure he doesn't get behind me. Because I was like, all right, Nick's, is, Nick's not having been in front of me for a while. I can still drive, like, I'm, you know, I'm just... Yeah. Or whatever because once someone's on the screen you're like Fuck. yeah because now i'm curious generally if that last lap was like how good will that last lap was gonna be oh we're doing this race again yeah because i want to because now i'm more curious now because out of all the tracks this is see this is the one you're your best at so i thought we was going to try to do the last one we can do that again after this shit Telling you people when when when, you, when there's like another yes I know you play extremely differently when there's another car right next to you or in front of you and you like fuck, you fuck, so, fuck, you, you, fuck, you, fuck 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 you so focus on the road. Oh shit.
I don't know how you crashed on the ramp that last time, though. Yeah, I think I hit that rock slew, slew me the fuck down. Slew me, yeah, slew me the fuck down. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, at that turn, I gotta actually slow down harder. It's the I hitting the grass isn't helping either, but I need to find a perfect spot to. Slow down, I'm still going fast and not hitting grass. That's the turn that's slowing me down the most. As soon as you make the break on the first turn and then it's now telling you to make a bigger turn, I need to slow down harder on that part. My best lap is the lap I went right past you. 4366. 44. It's still it's literally just the last two big turns is what slows me down the hardest. Alright. Yep, let's finish off with this one. Press start! This is their fault. Why would they put the button you use the most? That's that cancel button. In my screen, it looked like you fucking exploded. I need to try that turn again with going at top speeds and not fucking crashing like a fool.
I don't think it has to be said, but there's an obvious of obvious reasons why we're not the same, you know, as energetic as we are playing any other fucking video game. Because this one requires high, intense focus. The game's going so fast. I should I, I should have break earlier. Well, let's see how I do with this turn. Oh shit! Yeah, had no issues. Yeah, but you weren't necessarily going at top speed because you crashed at some point. You need to get. I, I'm trying to attempt to do that at max speed. I did it turn two after hitting a wall and then going over there. Like driving through the line and getting over there, but that's not, you know, that's not what I want. I want the peak difficulty. Well, that me. I, at least I went through without cr crashing. I keep forgetting that one spot. Also, I like how the game makes sure you can't fall off the cliff. We're just gonna push you back. See, I already lost my speed here. I'm not gonna be at max speed. Make this turn here. Ew. I'm still, I'm still going too fast on the turn. All right, here I go. Nope. This is probably like really, these type of games. They're only. This seems like the only games that would actively annoy the fuck out of me. Like, I never get really angry at video games, but this probably is the closest one. <laughs> and it's like, but Nick, you're doing fine. I don't care. If I'm not flawless, I'm garbage. I guess that turn. I guess you spin out on the turn. Mm -hmm. I wanted to not crash on that run on the right side again. So I go left and then I crash on the left side. I can't win. I guess that's my best version of that fucking turn. My best probably is like something 55, because both times I got 55. Now, both those times I did fucking crash. But like, Jesus. At a certain part of the race. It's just I've actually made the big turn not crashing. Yeah, that's the best of my 50 for my 55s. Well, unless we want to do more, that's a uh, virtual racing. Yeah, it's been about forty minutes. I guess that's long enough. So, how do you feel about virtual racing? I mean, I think it's incredible for what they did. But if you're asking Mark, would you play this for fun? I was like, oh, would I want it? I think I'd rather get it on the same Saturn. The Saturn version is. It's, I won't say it's an entirely different game, but it does not play the same. It doesn't feel the same. It, there's uh, there's new tracks. They add in more tracks. But yes, the game does not play the same because it's not done by the same devs. And they essentially had to rework the game from scratch 
because Sega was Sega and didn't give them anything they needed to port the game. Because they are amazing and uh, love Americans very much. Anywho. Well, yeah, that's uh, Virtual Racing. So, uh, I assume Sonic 2 is going on at this point. If not, the other game, the last game in the in the uh, Genesis lineup is uh, already happening. Where Whatever I fucking upload this. Anywho, we're almost near the end of the Segathon, but... I mean, well, for the, Gen almost, the Genesis portion of it. I'm about to say, we're not, we're not. We're, I was like, after we finish Genesis, we're halfway there. I'm Nick. I'm Mark. And this is BitRunner, shot through video game worlds bit by bit. Thanks for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe as a plane flies by. Mmm. And we'll see you uh, uh, further on. on no, no, you didn't say the things you gotta say. What? Oh, hit the notification bell. We, we have a Twitch and a Twitter. Blah, 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 blah. Anyway, so, we'll see you next time. On the next Sega game on the Sega Thon. Sega! Sega!